Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this video is going to be my September favorites video and a little quick update video. So it's been a minute since I actually sat down and filmed the videos. Majority of the videos that I was uploading um, were pre-recorded for the most part. So um, if you're really interested in seeing like why my time is so limited, um, I did a blog post um, not too long ago, maybe two, three days ago. Um, so if you want to see what's been going on in my life, go read the blog. Reading is fundamental, you guys. Um, I'll leave the link down in the description box. You can also see um, my update for my YouTube channel as in what, vi what videos has been requested and what I want to bring out on my channel. Um, I'm feeling really inspired and excited about the things that I'm plan on doing for my channel. Some of the videos are already filmed. Um, recently I just never got a chance to sit down and upload them. So um, I'm really excited about that. Um, if you have any requests please let me know now um, in the comment section because I am focusing on requested videos. I've been filming a lot of those so it's all about me helping and um, getting out the videos that you want to see. So if you have any requests, please leave them down below. Um, you will be seeing me upload videos and pushing the requested videos out. I know a lot of you probably like, I request the videos and she say request videos and she's not filming them, but I am. And um, I do read my messages and I do get my emails. I got a lot of emails recently about requests, which is, um, it was kind of odd to me at first because I'm like, why am I getting all these <laughs> emails about requests? But I feel free to email me requests if you feel that's the way you want to do it. Um, also, my hair. A lot of you are requesting natural hair videos. Please be patient. I am going to get the videos out. For the meantime, I did film a um, hair like video what products I use on my natural hair that video is going to be uploading and I also did a little video on like my little deep conditioning concoction that I do that works wonders for my hair it gives it really really soft so I'm going to upload that video as well as far as me doing natural hair tutorials I don't have the time to do it right now because like I said it's very limited if you want to know check out my blog once again um so my time is very limited. Um, I barely have time to do my hair. That's why I still have this same hair in my head. This is the um, the Free Trisnilla hair. I just cut it because I have tired of the long hair. I don't have time to do my hair or anything. So that's why I haven't really updated you on hair or did any new hair videos. I do have wigs that I purchased in new hair that I want to show you guys and review for you guys but I don't have the time to do so and film the videos show you how the hair looks before I actually alter the hair or anything so I want to just not do anything because I want to be fair and show you how the hair is and how it's like before I put it on my head so those videos will be coming I'll other um, updates or anything just go over to the blog and you can read it I'll update it today um, just to know let you know anything that I missed in this video I want to make it long so I want to get into my September favorites now um, I'm gonna start off with um, some of the products that I had in my shop my stash video if you haven't seen that video I will link it here um, and it'll explain what it is. And then I will also link my everyday staple products here because quite a few of you have requested that video. So if you're interested in seeing like the makeup that I grab on an everyday basis, I'll leave that here. So the first item that I'm going to share with you guys is this NYX Brown Lipstick in Lala. And I've worn this quite a bit and I'm proud of myself because I thought I wasn't going to wear it. But it's a really great purple shade. It's not that dark so you can get away with wearing it in the daytime. And I do have a swatch of this in this um, Shop My Stash video if you're interested. But I absolutely love this color. It's an amazing shade. So I've worn that quite a bit and I thought I wasn't even going to wear it. So I'm proud of myself for that. And the next item is the NYC... Um, lip stain and this one is in never ending nude 
I would have to tell you guys, I absolutely love this. At first when I got them, I was like, hey, I was a little iffy about them. But I absolutely love this. I wore this literally like every other day in September. And it's to the point where it's like I feel like I need another one because I don't think as much comes out as it used to. So I absolutely love this. It was great. I wore it with um, the MAC Soothe and Beige Tinted Moisturizers just to give it a little bit of a sheen because it do like dry like a matte finish. I love it. Um, the next item is my Victoria's Secret Lipstick and Breathe. This is like my everyday go-to color because it's like a peachy nude type color. I absolutely love this shade. Gorgeous. Um, I'm not sure if they sell that still, but if they do, I would highly recommend that shade. Um, the next item that was in my shop, my stash, is this Physician Formula Happy Booster Powder. And this is the bronzer. And I use this every single day. And it just gives me a really nice glow on my cheeks. I use it today. I don't know if you can tell. But it gave me a really nice glow. Absolutely love it. I just put the brush in and just put it on top. I just rub it all in. I don't go for no certain shade because it's quite a few shades. I just throw the brush and I put it on. It's really, really amazing. Um bronzer and then the last item from my shop my stash that I actually used quite a bit is this um, super flip palette by um, mark and this is how this is the side that I really use and it's the eyeshadow side I didn't use the lipstick side and this what I use this for like an everyday um, look and I did use it once for a um, like nighttime look so I use that quite a few times not as much as I wanted to but I used it quite a few times next um, two makeup items is the Mac two Mac lipsticks one is the one that I'm wearing right now and this is Riri Ho absolutely love this it's like a really nice berry shade and then the next one is Ruby Rue and I want this quite a bit. I, I just love this color. I do have Riri Roo, but for me, Riri Roo is a little bit lighter than Ruby Roo. And I just, I don't know. It's just something about this lipstick that I like. So I wore that quite a few times because I had um, a few parties that I went to in um, September. Um, and then I have... This um, e.l.f. 32 eyeshadow palette in warm. I don't know why, but for some reason I like to use this when it gets to fall time. Because it's great for everyday looks. Absolutely love it. I will be doing some tutorials with it because I absolutely love this um, palette. And it's affordable. And then I have this Coastal Scents 26 eyeshadow and blush combo palette that I've been using and it looks like this and I've been using the eyeshadows and this blush here I have it on today absolutely love it really gorgeous plum color um yeah so that's that and then I have three makeup brushes um two of them are the real technique brushes that I just love this one is the blush brush and I use it to apply my blush and then this one is the um, buffing brush that I use to apply my powder, uh, my mineralized skin finish powder, natural, or my um, MAC loose powder. And then I have this Sonia Kashuk double ended um, makeup brush. This pointed one, I typically use this to blend out the concealer under my eye. And then this part here, which is the sponge part, sometimes I like to um, use it for my makeup when I just want a subtle makeup look. And for my fragrances, I only have two items that I've been liking. This Paris Amour Body cream and hand cream whatever it's by bath and body works i absolutely love this stuff i tend to use this um body cream more than the spray in the 
in a shower gel. I just love it. And then I went back to using my Juicy Couture uh, perfume because there's something about the smell just, just, that just screams fall. So I absolutely love it. And I have the um, travel size little um, thing in my purse. Um, finally, last down to the food. Um, I really um, have been eating some of the same food items, so it's not really much I can show you. But um, I'm not sure if I showed this in my last video, but I love this um, Nature's Harvest Trail Mix. And it has cranberries, almonds, granola, dates, and cherries. And I got this from Walmart. Absolutely love this. Next is green tea. Love it. Um, I typically like to use drink it hot sometimes with my breakfast or drink it cold with a little bit of ice. And what I do to add a little bit of sweetness to it is I either I use honey or I use Splenda a little bit, just not a lot. Um, and then I have been loving smoothies. I do make my own smoothies, but sometimes I don't feel like making them. And this is the Bull House Farms brand. This is strawberry banana. And I don't drink this whole thing. This is the 32 ounce. I only drink eight ounces and it's, that's the serving size. But um, my mom recently picked up me up some because they were on sale for two for five dollars at Target for these big ones. Um, I do drink the green one as well. This is the one I just grabbed. And then I also drink the naked juices too, which was what I was drinking before my mom got me those because they was on sale. But um, yeah, that's it. Hopefully this video wasn't too long and or boring. Um, hope that you guys enjoyed. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.